It's time. So striding in, Art McLean, and we are set for baseball here this evening. There's a good fastball on the outside corner as you'll take a look at strike one. Fellas, you take a look at our home standing ball club as they come into this one tonight. They come in winners of two straight, and they've been playing some good base. Well, yeah, Matty B, we're looking at a team right now. They're just playing some average baseball through four games of this homestand. They split it two and two, D-Row, and I think they expect a little bit more. Yeah, and you don't want to be playing average baseball in front of your home fans. They need to find a way to win this game and, and, and try and take three out of the first five of this homestand. So it was a strikeout swinging. Part McLean becomes the first out of the inning, and he will make the play out there, and there are two away now. First pitch coming, here first. it is. And here's a fastball Ready. called for strike one. Machado. And he watches a called strike at the knees. No balls and two strikes. I guess he's really trying to one, measure one, that one. fastball in his first at bat, but you really never want to put yourself. And the throw to first is there. The inning is over. So a relatively routine start for the top of the first. Leading off the inning, Fred McGowan. And they'll need him to get something going here. No balls in one strike. McGowan. Swing and a miss, and he's in control 0-2. On the ground over to first. Cho moving to his right, and he'll take this to the bag himself, and the leadoff man set down to start the second. Not a lot you can do with that pitch. That fastball just ate him up inside and gets the soft grounder for the out. That is it. So one away here with the bases Austin. empty, and Austin Meadows will be the next to bat. Oh, and he's really getting the better of him now. It's strike two. Every time you go out there to start a game on the mound, you hope to settle in quickly and get into a groove. And he's definitely done that so far in the early going. Looks like he could go pretty deep into this one. Got him swinging on the fastball there. Austin Meadows is sent packing for route number two in the inning. That Stepping here. in now, Rico Nunez. 0-1 the count. Nunez. Oh, he's got to be more disciplined here. It's 0-2. Two. two out, nobody on. Swing and a miss, and that ends the inning. So they breeze through this half of the inning. Hey, and that will bring up the former right first-rounder, Christian Arroyo. And his guys have quite a hill to climb. Down five zip here in the early going. Lots of baseball left in this one as we're still early on, but you don't want to fall too far behind. They're already down by a bundle, and one of the things you want your leadoff guy to get on and set the table for the big boys to start driving in some runs. Got him to go down swinging there. Christian Arroyo goes down for the first out here in inning number three. The second baseman. Gregorio Castro. Now the pitch. Pulled high in the air out to left field. Moving under it, Adair. And he makes the catch for the second out. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. The right fielder. Strike one to start the at bat. The wind up and the 0 1. And he fouls this one off. The wind up and the 0-2 pitch. Got him swinging as he runs the fastball by him to end the inning. Make it nine straight here to start the ball game. Leading off the inning, Art McLean, and they'll need him to get something going here. Number 13. First pitch on its way. Fastball taken, but that gets the zone for a strike. Looking to punch him out again, the pitch. A swing and a miss on a ball way out of the zone, and there's one away. Ready now, Eddie Marmalejo. He flew out in his last at bat. And that's on the outside corner for a strike. One out, nobody on. Maybe a little jumpy there as he swings through the fastball. 
And he missed with it. It's one and two. Jeez, finally. That's the first ball they've taken all night. Do it again, I dare you. Hit on the ground out to short. Dunham is right there. Throw in time as he's called out on a bang-bang play at first. Digging in, Ray Machado. He got on top of one. It was a ground out victim last time. One ball, no strikes to count. High in the air into shallow left center. Adair moving in. He gets there to make the catch, and that ends the inning. Digging in to try it again, Fred McGowan. He'll try and do what he can to work toward cutting into this big deficit. No balls and a strike to count. The 0-2 once more. Gets the outside corner, strike three. He's just ringing up strikeouts left and right. But what's really impressive to me, he hasn't now walked that, anyone either. He's just hit. pounding the zone. Yeah. His stuff is dirty today. 0-1 the count. The windup and the 0-1. Fastball called for strike two. Sort of surprising to see a five-hole hitter take two in a row for strikes to start in a bat. Now he's way behind the count, so we'll see if he can battle back. That one misses two. one and two. Bases are empty, one man out. Up, up, Hopped up. up. Ward in foul ground. Fence, fence, fence. And he brings it in on the warning track. Ready for another chance. Rico Nunez. Now he looked to bounce back oh, after striking out Rico. his last time two, two, up. Two, two, That's two, a Nunez. base hit, their first of the game. Hey, this team has been shut down offensively up until this point, Dan. But right here, team's first hit at a game in the fifth inning. Let's see if it sparks yeah, them bad. offensively. You know, this will be interesting, d to see first if they game. can crack this guy's well, code. A lot of times, once you get that first hit, several begin to fall after that one. So it'll be interesting to see if this guy can put the screws on this one and tighten things up and not allow any more base hits. From the belt, kicks and deals. And he struck him out, his eighth punch out of the ball game, and that one ends the inning. Now at the plate, Gregorio Castro will start things out in their half of the sixth as they look to shake things up here for a lineup that, quite frankly, has been non-existent to date. No doubt about that, Matt. They've been completely overmatched to this point. One hit through five innings. I mean, what else can you say about the pitching they faced other than it's been fantastic. We'll see if that continues as we approach the later inning. He froze him on the breaking ball that time. Now, Gregorio Mike Castro Cuba. goes down Brian. to become the first out Don't in the sixth go. inning. One out, nobody on. Here's a fastball that crowds him a bit, and it's one and one. Right up. Here's right a up. high pop-up. Ward is me, there. Me, 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 me. Two down. Now in the box, Art McLean, and now he's bad. likely just trying to put one in 13. play here. 0 for 2 with a pair of strikeouts thus far. This offense is going to have to find a way to get going. It's happened in the past. Every team no goes ball. through Good it where strike. everyone seems to fall into a funk at the same time. Everyone needs to relax and not try and be the hero and just start getting the leadoff guy on. The next 0-2 oh. misses, and that'll move it to 1-2 one one now. Up, up, him up. Up. Merritt over to his left. I go, I go. No trouble with this one, and the inning is over. Make it six shutout innings as he continues to give him fits up. Leading off the inning, Eddie Marmalejo, and they'll need him to get something going here. Fastball Eddie. in there for a called strike. Marmalejo. Objective number one right here one, is one, finding one. a way to get on base. So I'm not surprised to see him taking on the first pitch there. And the throw to first is in time. So the leadoff man is gone here to start inning number seven. 
First delivery to him now on the way. Catch. In there, 0 and 1. Machado. Line to the right side, but right to the second baseman, and that's the second out. Here comes the first pitch. Now batting. Fouled off. Fielder. Fred. McDowell. Bases are empty here with two men out. Ward trying to get there, fouled away. And he will strike him out. Ten now in the ball game, and the inning is over. So he keeps rolling right along. So stepping in, Austin Meadows. We're in the eighth now, and nothing's changed out there on the mound. Well, I've been very impressed with how this starter's going about his business, Matt. He's looked really sharp, and it's hard to know if it's had any effect, but getting that early lead from his offense could have really helped settle him in. Three and oh now. And a good take there will net him a base runner as it's ball four now to start the eighth inning. Digging in and looking for more. Rico now Nunez, that, that, one for two on his line so Rico. far in the game. Ball Nunez. one to start the at bat. Goes the other way, and this is in the air out to left. Adair will settle under it to make the play for the first out as the runner will have to head back to first. Striding in, Christian Arroyo. He got called out on strikes his last time through. No balls in one strike. And that misses one and one. Hey, one down now. Well, one that two seam fastball ran a little too Here much off the plate, but now that sets him up to work with something away and maybe even an off speed pitch. Struck him out. Struck him out again, I should say. His third punch out of the game. What's your take on all the strikeouts we see Second in the base. game today, Dan? That was his Gregorio. third tonight, and it seems we're That's seeing that a lot more these days. Yeah, Matt, there's been a real change in philosophy. And we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three, and that will retire the side. Kicking off the top of the ninth, Brian Campillo, and they'll need him to get something going here. One and oh, the count. The 1-0. -oh. Misses, ball two. All over the place to start the ninth. It's 3-0 and now. Well, knowing the threat this guy poses if he gets on base, I think the next pitch should be a challenge pitch. You don't want to give guys that can run a free chance to cause havoc out there, especially the leadoff guy. First pitch fastball in there for a called strike. Nice job by the pitcher right there to establish himself back into the strike zone. Would have liked to have seen the hitter been a little bit more aggressive in that situation. Usually when a pitcher throws four balls in a row, that next pitch, you can get super greedy right down the middle. Digging in once again, Eddie Marmalejo. He's their last shot here with two away in the ninth as they look to avoid the shutout. Yeah, and that, they just haven't had any answer for the great pitching so far in this one. And this is swung on and missed, so now they find themselves down to their final strike tonight. Swing and a miss. He struck him out, and that'll do it here as the ball game is over. Oh, man. So close, but yet so far. Can you imagine giving up one hit, pitching such good baseball for nine innings, but one base hit kept him from baseball history. Five nothing.